Welcome back to Shop and see everybody. My name is Jerry Hughes, and this is the debut of Nixon Watches. I'm going to get right to it. Item number J123456, introductory price tonight of $299.99. This watch sells for more than $700 in stores. Six value pays tonight, $49.99, interest free. Three color choices, white, black, and brown. Nixon Watches has been around since 1997. They offer a wide array of watches at different price points. However, this one is the cream of the crop, the Rotolog watch, and my personal favorite, the black Rotolog. It is a piece of art that is going to be on your wrist. Why does it look like a piece of art? Because it is completely scratch free and scratch resistant. It is one of the best features of it. Whether you have this watch for one year or ten years, it's going to look like the day you bought it. Another wonderful thing I love about this watch is the butterfly clasp in the back. When it shuts, it is sound, but it's absolutely seamless and gorgeous, and it looks like a bracelet absolutely gorgeous. My producers are telling me right now that the phone lines are lighting up and the black is going really, really quickly. I also would like to let you know that the testimonial line is open. Make sure you call and give me a call right now. Another wonderful feature about Nixon watches is their two-year warranty. They stand by their products and that is really a peace of mind when you buy this watch. The two-year warranty is, is priceless. Once again, J123 Four five six introductory price two ninety nine ninety nine six value pays forty nine ninety nine color choices black white and brown it has been a pleasure to debut this watch with you tonight have a wonderful night. He's been taking his story to Africa, India, and prisons and schools right here at home. Jerry started the Hughes Foundation in 2004. They fund an orphanage in Namibia and sponsor youth camps in India. But the most important part of Jerry's work is sharing his story. So by the end of that year, I decided I'm going to start the Hughes Foundation. I didn't know what to call it. I didn't even know how you form this thing. I just knew I had a passion. And I went to India. And I spoke, and I met all these people who were living with HIV and AIDS. At that point in my life, I, I was like, wow, floored at all the devastation caused by one disease. It's very weird to say this, but it's affected me in such a positive way. When you help anybody, when you help people in life, you're, you're always blessed. And you're always um, given back tenfold what you think you've given. And so when I can speak into the life of a child or a youth or a woman, uh, it, it, my life is so rich. For those that um, don't know about the name, for those that didn't hear about it yet, just a brief background about the foundation. Well, basically, I started the Hughes Foundation in 2004 after being infected with HIV myself. Uh, it just came out of a passion, and I wanted to do something, make a difference in the world for those who are affected by HIV, because we're all affected in essence. I'm like, there's 42 million people living with HIV worldwide. Where are they? And I wanted to know who are these people? What do they look like? And I couldn't find them. And so it was... By the end of that year, that's when I started the Hughes Foundation. And that's when I decided I'm not going to let these statistics make, stop me from living. And so I started living. And since then, I've gone, gone around the world. What makes me relatable to the Shop NPC viewer is truly been my experiences in life. I'm able to connect with anybody really in life simply by my own personal journey that I've led. And what makes me really relate in that way to people is simply for the fact that I've traveled to India and I've been with a woman who's dying of AIDS at her bedside. I've also been in meetings with the CEO of Deloitte and Touche of Manhattan. I'm able to relate to people no matter where they're at in life and I'm able to connect to people not only in a sense of style on the outside but definitely on the inside. And I think what Shop NBC does really, really well is bringing quality products, but it's also great to have quality hosts that not only look good on the outside, but also on the inside. People can identify with my story. We, it, it, stories need to be told in life. Whatever someone's going through, uh, you, you are lovable, you are beautiful, and, and you have a purpose in life. And that's really what my message is all about. When I go to these schools, I want these kids to know that no matter what you're going through, where you've been, or where you're going, you have a purpose in your life. You have a plan, you are smart, you are gifted. Use it and believe in yourself. Really want to come, come, come across loud and clear is to love yourself. Even if your parents don't love you, your family, love yourself. 
because there's a plan and there's a purpose for your life no matter where you're at or what it looks like there's a plan and there's a purpose and it starts with you what motivates me and what I'm passionate about in life truly is people and a step further than that is making people happy people are a priority to me in my life and I make them a priority and seeing people happy is sincerely the biggest priority I have in my life and I realized that something as simple as new diamond earrings, a ring on the hand, clothes, can sometimes make people happy. They make makes them feel better on the inside. And so I'm very passionate ultimately about people and the viewers who are watching me on Shopping BC, I'm mostly concerned about them and I'm concerned about making sure that they get a product that I believe in personally because if I believe in it, then they are going to believe in it. And I want to see those consumers happy with what they're getting as a product, but I don't want to be considered just a salesperson as a host, someone selling them something like a used car dealership. I want them to be able to tune in and say, wow, this guy really makes me feel good. This guy really encouraged me today. This guy really made me feel beautiful and special. And that, I think, is a gift and a key in selling that needs to happen more at Shopping C. Yus, a popular international motivational speaker, interacted with his audience and encouraged them to actively participate in the discussions and to share their experiences with each other. How many of you know what Namibia is? Ooh, right. All right. Ms. Smith, you need some geography. Step it up a little bit. Namibia is right above South Africa, in Africa. And uh, we've been going to Namibia now for three years. And uh, this past year I was in Namibia, I was over World AIDS Day. How many of you know what World, when World AIDS Day is? Oh. December 1st, Ms. Smith. <laughs> <laughs> Ms. Smith, I think you to the principal after this. When I go into a store, I love to go into stores that have energy, stores that make me feel good, that offer great products that fit me well, that fit my personality, that fit my style. That is truly why I go into a store. Another reason I go into stores and I keep going back to those stores is because of the people. The people who are serving me, the people that I can trust, the people that are sincere, the people that aren't lying to me and telling me I look good when I don't look good, the people that are just truly sincere and humble people. That is truly why I go back into stores. But the point is, is that you have to have that relationship that relationship needs to be there in order for me to go back. The same thing applies with Shopping BC. The reason I think uh, people go back to Shopping BC and tune into Shopping BC is, yeah, because of the products. The products are great, they're quality products, but another reason is because people connect to the host. I've been working for an advertising agency for the past six years, uh, and my client, five of those years, has been Shopping BC. I know the host, I know the product, I know the vendors, I know the consumer, I know who is sitting in their living room and their dining room watching Shopping BC. I know them because I've studied them and I've, I've sent them direct marketing for the past five years. I know who they are. And so, really, my path in marketing and advertising has been a great path and journey that has led me to Shop Me See and a perfect launching pad to be a host on Shop Me See.